All right, in this video we're going to see how to graph the quadratic equations of two variables, graph a parabola using technology. Um, again, we're going to look at using Desmos to do this. The example I'm going to use is this model I have for interpreting the vertex and intercepts. So let's go ahead and open up Desmos. So we need to put the equation in. It's uh, y equals negative 2500x squared plus 159,000x. So we're going to have to do some adjusting on the window here. Remember to click the wrench to change the grass settings. Uh, if you went through and bound the intercepts, you know that we're really looking at um, well, let's go from negative 5 to 75, because the other one's at 63 and the y value start at negative 10 and go to the maximum ended up being about 2.5 million so let's go up to 3 million looks pretty good. I'm going to label the axes since I'm in this window anyway. So the situation was that x or p was the price per subscription in dollars. And on the vertical axis we're looking at the revenue also in dollars. Right, that looks good. We just need to add in points. So put a point at the vertex and at each of the intercepts. Here we just have two x-intercepts because the origin is an x and a y-intercept. If you had a different x and y-intercept, you want to mark all three, right? Both x-intercepts and the y-intercept. So you may have a fourth point that you have to locate for your problem. Otherwise, this is ready to go. Uh, remember, to really get this exported right, you have to sign in. So either sign in or use a screenshot, um, something like the snipping tool. So I'm going to snip it. And that doesn't look very good. Also, still has this thing. There we go. That looks pretty good. So then you could save that image as a JPEG or something like that, or just post it into a presentation. Alternatively, you can sign in. And once you sign in, then you have the option to share the graph. And you can just take image. And you can click it to download it. And that looks a little better, actually. Okay, so that's graphing a parabola using technology.